Jack, be nimble, Jack, be quick. Your mom just caught you playing with your joystick. <laughs> anyway, why do I do these things? Why do people let me do these things? So, anyway, got a few updates for you guys. Uh, there's some stuff coming down the pipeline. There's a really, really, really huge thing coming I wish I could talk more about right now, but I just simply can't. I'm sorry, guys. I'm not trying to be weird, but you will know within the next 7 to 14 days or so because the first episode of it will be up. And there will be a co-host, and it's going to be very unique, unlike anything else on YouTube, as far as the gaming industry goes. Second announcement, we have kicked around the idea for, well, about as long as we've kicked around Zoomsy before we finally got rid of him, but uh, at any rate, we've kicked around the idea of doing a legit on the money scheduled twitch stream so we had you know what let's put aside his skill for a minute he is an amazingly skilled player but army joined us today and army is well versed in streaming and he actually tried to start a program, but he just didn't have the support that he will absolutely get from the Destin Knights. And you can look forward to our Twitch channel being very active on a very regular basis with Army running the show from upstairs for the Twitch program. So. There will be many, many more Twitches coming from the Destin Knights. So I wanted to let you guys know about that. And I have another announcement. We have, well, we've. this is another idea we've kicked around for a long time. And that's doing a weekly podcast. We're actually about to start the weekly podcast And real briefly, the format is going to be formatless-ish. In, er, kinda, I don't know. It's going to be mostly us talking about destiny, the state thereof, what's coming down the line with Red Dead and other games and guns and just all things gamer. And just having a healthy discussion about what's going on in the gaming world, specifically Destiny and games we feel that are in line with that kind of gaming. So the podcast will start each week. Now here's what's going to be unique about it. We will have a topic of the week every single week. Our very first topic is going to be Crucible Sniping. And our very own Young Killers is going to be our special guest. You're welcome for that just now advance notice, Mark. He is going to be our special guest that kind of lets us pick his brain a little bit and tell us what frustrates him what he's working on, what he feels is successful, the sources he likes to go to to try to learn from, and we're going to have a really good conversation with him. I'm thinking we're going to do about an hour long one, maybe 30, somewhere between 30 minutes and an hour. There will be a co-host. I am not at this time going to tell you who the co-host will be. Because they probably going to be the hostess with the mostest, man. So, until then, I want to be the most popular host. So, I'm not telling. So, we got that coming down the line. The podcast is finally happening. And then, we have something. It'll probably start out springboarding off the Baltimore Dude YouTube channel. It's going to be two to five minute videos, somewhere in that area, 
that we upload very, very, very frequently. Here's the uniqueness to it. Myself and Omen Schechter will be doing this particular one. I'm not at liberty to tell you the name or the content of the show yet, but I can tell you it's absolutely going to be something YouTube is completely void of. And we're looking forward to that. In fact, we're over the moon excited about it. And Owen actually has a talent a lot of you don't even realize. He and I both share, and that's musical talents. Uh, I've done it in studios and made a career out of it, and he's breaking into that part of it. So you will get to hear some original music from both of us as we do it. Some just because it's funny, some because it's just cool stuff we're proud of, we've worked on. But it's mostly going to be a comedy show, but it's going to be very, very fast-paced. And it's going to provide you a service of learning on the fly in a hurry. That's all I can really say about that. I'm sorry, guys. I wish I could tell you more. And we're also about to start back up TDK Gives Back. And that's going to be... And we're not going to do it like the douchebags in streams. Well, if you've been in my stream for so many hours, you've earned four dildos and get five more dildos and you get a carry we're not playing that game we will raffle it off but in a much more dignified uh what's the words i'm looking for a much more dignified stop pitying and padding my pockets kind of way and i'm sorry that's just the way i feel about it no offense to anyone That's how I feel about it. So we're going to be kicking back up TDK Gives Back. And basically what that means is for the people who, I mean, there's a few credentials you have to have to even be eligible. We can't very well take a 170 through Wrath of the Machine challenge mode. So you will have to have a few credentials depending on what you pick. But see, here's the thing. You have your pick. You have your pick of us taking you to win the raid of your choice. Or we can send two of our best PvP players to do Osiris with you. Now, if you do Osiris, understand we will send you our best. But some nights are just one of those nights, and you know how it goes, and the lag switchers, and the Satans, and so forth and so on. So we absolutely cannot guarantee a flawless, but we can guarantee a pretty solid run, no matter how that turns out. But you get your choice, and TDK gives back. So that's coming back down the pike. We have a lot of TDK challenges that will be returning. Both, I start to say both. Uh, There's far more than both now. There's going to be TDK challenges where we push ourselves to the light limits. And we go back to VOG and Crota and Skolos and King's Fall and see what we can do without the padding of all that extra light. And just to make it really interesting, we're going to do it with green back weapons on some of them and blue back weapons on others. So... It's going to be a whole lot of fun. So as you guys can see, and I know I'm missing some things, so make sure you check the afterthoughts in the subscri- subscription. In the description, because I guarantee I'm missing some things that I will think of once I've uploaded because I'm old, I'm feeble, and I forget things. And I'm sitting on the toilet at this very moment while I'm making this. And and, I'm just kidding with you. Um, There's a lot of things coming down the pipeline, and I'm so, so excited about the things you know about. I am just elated for the thing I can't talk much about yet. 
and I am so proud of the crew we are rocking right now. I really feel like, and I've said this before, but I feel like this is the strongest top to bottom crew we have ever had. I really feel that. Even our guys that can't be there all the time are just complete badasses and they just they're money makers when they show up so it's been a lot of fun there's a lot more to come there's a lot of things that are time gated in rise of iron one more announcement i have a video that's going to be coming out and i will no doubt lose a few friends over this friends in high places I will no doubt lose some subs over this, but you know what? That's okay, because there's some truths that need to be told, and some people won't tell them because of endorsements, and they've got beggar buttons all over their websites, and that's how they're building houses and doing what they're doing and I don't I'm not the guy that begrudges anyone of anything if you work hard and you earn it then by God spend it and enjoy it but when you're doing it in a deceitful manner and putting on a mask every morning or afternoon or night or Osiris weekend then we got to talk about it. And you know what? I'm not popular enough yet to give a damn if they get mad at me. So I'm going to be that guy. So there's going to be a scathing video coming from yours truly. I will sound angry at times, but I promise you I am not angry. I have just bit my tongue for so long. I've damn near bit that some bitch in half. And I'm not going to bite it no more. We're going to have some real, real, real conversation. Probably have some guests in for that. So, tons of things coming down the pipeline. Those are the headline things. Don't forget to check the afterthoughts. If you want to get a hold of me, it's always easiest. I know in the one video I said Twitter, but I don't know why I said that. It's always easiest to hit me up on PlayStation Network. I know that other thing, X broken one to buckle my disk drive thing has communication too. But I use PS4 because I like things that turn on. So, uh, except my ex-wife, she can, you know, well, you know, she can jump off a bridge and get turned on by barbed wire, but I'm not mad about it. So, at any rate, hit me up on PSN. I am Baltimore Dude, all one word, B-A-L-T-I-M-O-R-E-D-U-D-E, no weirdness to it, all one word. Over on Twitter, I am at Baltimore underscore dude. Bang the thumbs up. Go ahead and crowdy chop the subscribe button. Leave a comment and just be part of what's going on here. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all your support. I'm Baltimore dude. As always, I'll catch you next video.